Today, dozens of people rallied outside of Miami City Hall, many of them against a new bill that would ban homeless encampments on public property and entryways. Last week, the city of Miami commissioners gave the initial approval to the ordinance, but the final vote was pushed to tonight. CBS 4's Ashley Dyer is outside of City Hall waiting for a decision from commissioners. Ashley. Lauren, if the ordinance passes, it means that homeless people would no longer be able to use tents or temporary housing structures on public property. The push for this bill coming as the homeless population continues to increase. Three to four thousand is the official number on any any single day. We took this video today on Northwest 17th Street, where several people live inside tents on the sidewalk. That is that is a way how people protect from the weather. Okay. Why would they take that away? The saddening site is a never-ending issue, one that's worsened during the COVID-19 pandemic. Well, Miami Dave has a very bad homeless problem. The ordinance would enable code enforcement officers to issue fines and police to arrest anyone found in an unlawful encampment. I am a United States veteran and I am ashamed of America. At Miami City Hall, protesters gathered to show support for the homeless population. I am strongly against the criminalization of homelessness. While others in favor of the bill voice their concerns to commissioners. We are being attacked every day by the homeless people. Police were on scene as protesters became a little heated. Commissioner Carollo pushing his idea for an adopt a homeless person assistance program, which is exactly what it sounds like. The program would provide aid to homeowners willing to take in and care for a homeless person. Some people are in support of the idea. We should be doing all we can to help our neighbors and community members experiencing one of the biggest hardships of their lives. The bill has the support of all commissioners except one. Right now, they are inside City Hall getting close to making that final decision. As soon as they have a decision, you can count on us to let you know. I'm live at City Hall, Ashley Dyer, CBS4 News.